Okay, so um, if you use a donor egg, it's a piece of cake, really. Uh, the um, uh, Every time we would transfer one embryo, the chance of a baby would be somewhere around 60%. So if you trans, if you have two embryos from that donor egg, uh, then you can just figure 60% of 40% is 24%. So that means your cumulative chance of having at least one baby is 84% after uh, two embryos. But if you have three embryos, you can do the math and you've got a 94% chance of having at least one baby. And uh, from donor eggs, you're likely to have three embryos if it's a or if it's a fresh uh, donor. If it's a frozen donor, it's a whole totally different story because the egg banks will split those donor eggs up four or five or even six ways. So they're only going to give you six eggs, and you're probably only going to get one embryo. You may get no embryos, but you're probably going to get one embryo. So um, you're not going to have those extra embryos. So in that situation, it would be about 60%. But if you get three embryos, it's obviously going to be at least 94% successful. Uh, and uh, so the unless you have something terrible in your uterus, which can always be fixed, uh, your chance of success strictly depends on the age of that donor and also the quality of uh, the laboratory doing the freezing. <laughs>